The Evolution Sportster has been around for a minute, since 1986 in fact, a bit too late for the custom craze of the 70s. It was born into a world of changing attitudes about motorcycling in general, and a burgeoning new market among the so-called rich urban biker crowd. You know, the folks that 10 years prior would have rolled up their windows and locked their doors when the Harley pulled up next to them at a light, and couldn't change a needle valve if you held a cocked 1911 to their head. Catering to this crowd was a smart move by the company, cause if you want to make money, you have to make a product for people who have money. While the Evo Big Twins, most notably the Soft Tails, benefited early from efforts to tie into Harley's deep roots, Sportster design sort of stagnated, seemingly satisfied to continue the general design characteristics established by the K model in 1952, and subsequent Ironhead Sportsters up through 85, with minor variations. Fast forward to 2016, and the Sportster 7 Tie 2 that plums the depths of the outlaw, custom culture of the 70s, a look that is now once again in vogue with the new guard, and has shed a lot of the stigma attached to the originals. Continue reading for my review of the 2016 Harley-Davidson 72.